So in this video, I'm going to do a comparison test between an older Mac 2013 model 16 GB RAM i7 Quad 4 processor 512 GB RAM. Whereas the newer Mac that is with M1 chip and it is 32 GB RAM, 2 TB hard drive. So I'm going to compare uploading of videos. In the last I'm going to edit the videos in iMovie software from Apple and we'll see if the older Mac is better or if the newer Mac is better in that. And if you edit a lot of videos in iMovie then you should watch this video. It will help you a lot. It will also give an idea if there is anything related to the heat issues and if anything the fan noise if they also worry you then you should watch this video it will make you clear which Mac is better for you. This is the MacBook Pro Retina 15 inch late 2013 MacBook Pro 16 inch 2021. If we look at the size so while checking the size I can show you like as you can see up to a SD card. The newer version is thicker whereas the older version is smaller both of them have SD card port and HDMI ports. The only difference is the USB ports like it has USB ports where this one has only USB-C ports. Now I'm going to upload a video clip and I'll see how fast it takes to upload the older Mac so it has appeared and I'm going to upload this clip so I select import selected so it took around 21 seconds let's go to the other one here we go the SD card in so it has shown up quickly the another one so I can select the file. Let's see how many seconds it takes. Start. So it took around only 18 seconds. So there is a difference in time in uploading. So let's export the movie. So for example, I have this clip here. Now in this older Mac, I'm going to select the same clip. So same size 1080p. Now I'm going to start it at the same time. One, two, three. So there is no big difference. It hardly maybe a second. At this time the file size will be one GB. So I'm going to export it. Number two, desktop. Same in the newer Mac share file 1080p 1 GB file number 2 at the desktop so I'm going to start it again I hope there is a difference now the trackpad and the click is little bit easier on the newer Mac so one two three here is a big difference the older Mac can process a iMovie quicker than the newer Mac with the more memory now that is surprising because if you are using your Mac to edit videos and if you just want to edit in the iMovie is performing better than the newer Mac I'm really surprised with it. So I'm going to do a final test and here I have increased the size of the file. So it's going to be 2.2 GB file and that is 1080p. Save to desktop. So I'm going to start now 1, 2, 3. So I can see the older Mac is faster in processing. There is no change in fan speed. 
temperature is 36 temperature is 32 I can hear the fan noise has started to come in the older Mac no fan noise in the newer one let's check the temperature temperature is 38.3 no change in temperature so file is processed here it will show up it is still processing it has processed as well so let's see it has appeared here it's around six seven seconds late so that's a big difference there is no change in temperature in newer one now the temperature has reduced now only difference I can see here is like it's the fan noise the fan came up in the older Mac quickly the older Mac is hotter newer one is not that much it's almost cold so I can say it's easy to use the newer Mac in your lab because the temperature won't increase the fan noise is not a problem there is no fan noise in that whereas in this this Mac you can't hold it longer in your lap if you are processing lot of videos it will it's going to be really hot the fan noise can be an issue if you don't like because it's going to produce a lot of noise then I think you should be going to the newer one because there won't be any noise in that